Alright, so what is everybody? This is Adel Witch. We're bringing you another comment out about the Red War gameplay. Let's play the Chronic Mode. Um. Sorry, long pause there. So, what to talk about, honestly? First off, I want to go off and just say I watched the new episode of Wizard. Things are getting interesting. Uh, Nito fought the White Wizard, got his ass kicked again. Mayu saves. Mayu saves Nito from getting killed by the White Wizard, all that fun stuff. The. The head of the Depart Department of Defense of Japan got found badly injured. Gets crazier. Sent to the hospital. All that fun stuff. Koyomi did not re did not get any memory back. But something interesting did happen. Haruto's inside the author's underworld where the all Dragon Four made his return. And things get a little crazy from there. Apparently, Fuki is the father of Koyomi, so now things are getting a little cuckoo. Um, it's getting insane. Now the story is starting to unravel. Why? Why is it that Fuki gave her own, his own daughter to Haruto to take care of? Now it's going to get a little bit more insane. Which I'm starting to wonder what is up with that dark looking ring. Maybe it's a ring to bring her back to life, or maybe give her eternal life, or maybe it has something to do with using her to create more phantoms or another Sabbath for the for the wise men. Who knows? Things are getting a lot interesting here. And how is it that Sora knew where the White Wizard was? Now. It's getting more and more interesting. What is Sora's role in all of this? After meeting Wise Man, after meeting the White Wizard, after all of that, what is his new role now? It, it's starting to unravel a little bit. Alright, so, enough about that. Shikinger. <laughs> we know for a fact Shikinger, basically, when uh, Power Rangers Samurai first debuted it, it was all just carbon copies of every freaking episode, right? Now we know truly Mako cannot cook, almost kills none other than who else? Almost kills Takiru the cooking, and it gets nuts. We all know Mako can't cook, we all know, uh, we all know that Mr. I want to make sure that everything goes perfect. Inosuke does not like Genta until that turned around a little bit. But you know what? It, you know what? I, I think Shinkiju does a better job than Samurai did, honestly. Though only one thing that kind of set it apart was the. was, uh. who else? I'm going to say Decker again. Why? I do like the Decker actor from Power of Samurai a little bit more than the Shinkinger one. Shinkinger one is a little bit more mysterious. But the Decker one kind of just went like that. A snap. Just like that. Just became something instant that I could really see right there. I think he was a really badass actor. I'm not going to take anything away from the Shinkinger actor who played this in, but you know what? I do like it. Shigajur is better than Samurai right then and there. Yes, that's not the purism talking, it's fact. Honestly, I could get more out of Shigajur than I can out of Samurai, because Samurai just had so many stuff that did not make any freaking sense. Um, speaking of Samurai, <laughs> we all know the purism problem, right? You know what I mean? Like, I know I could be purist sometimes, but this is the fanboy in me. But I can tell you this, here honestly, we do not run around and make freaking petitions where almost 40 something people would sign to cancel Super Mega Force. Are you freaking kidding me? And then you go off with your purism but butthurtness and you just running around saying, Oh, what is this about? Come up with their own ideas. Hello, they did come up with their own ideas. What about, oh, I don't know, the Titanium Ranger? That was obviously not from Sentai. The Spirit Rangers in Jungle Fury was not from Sentai. The A team from or a unit from from SPD, not from Sentai. All of it was original. Every one of it was all Saban original. So I do not understand why you guys gotta be such bitches. Oh, the Ranger keys are bulky. Ooh, it doesn't look like the Japanese one. Ooh, ooh. Seriously, 
it's, it's kind of an annoyance, like really. I mean, hell, you guys never bitched when Gosages showed up because then nobody really cared. I actually cared. I actually like Gosages, but when now this is the thing, people are gonna bitch when Comrade Forze gets adapted, which is just a rumor, but I think will come true because I can really see why Forze should be adapted. But come on now, guys, seriously. I can see many reasons why Forza should be adapted. There's some educational purposes in it. There's some morals in it. There's so much that it could be done. <clears throat> now I'm kind of having. Now I'm kind of being a little bit of a purist here, but I'm not sure that if it will surpass Forza, the, the original, or not. That is the thing. A lot of people said, "Oh, Dragon Knight surpassed Yuki." I think not. I say, hell no, it didn't. I like Yuki more. Honestly, I didn't even need to watch Dragon Knight. Well, I saw the previews and I just said to myself, okay, it's better. Yeah, Ryuki is better than this. Because honestly, I can relate to the writers in Ryuki over the fact that, oh, this Dragon Knight. Really? Really? Seriously? I mean, hell, it's like people bitched about Mass Rider, which I honestly think it was a horrible idea. So much kind of cheap editing and all that fun stuff. It was even frames of uh, Kotaro. It gets a little bit insane. I know the purism is talking. And yes, my new um, batch of Shinkajou is going to be downloading. I'm going to be continuing on watching that. Uh, anywho, so I just passed the episode where Decayed and everybody else, you know, all the writers. Riders, decayed, all that stuff. So it's around 21, 20, 21 or so that that'll happen. But you know, it's really good. I like Shinkinger a lot. Go back to the butt hurtness. Seriously? Let's get serious here, guys. Nobody bitched when you guys. Okay, so I, I'm getting this a lot whenever I go around saying, without power. Like, seriously, without Power Rangers, we wouldn't know about Super Sentai. We would be stuck with Ranger purism and the heartbeat. We would be stuck with that. But since it branched out and we went to where it really came from, now we get more of a knowledge that a lot of people don't have. But, you know what? I cannot take anything away from the hardworking actors on the American side and the Saban brand and all that fun stuff. I cannot take that away from them. They're... They put in their time and hard work to take an adaptation and put a lot into it. Neither can I take away anything from Toei or their actors. They took a lot of time and effort to make all of that. But what people got to realize is stop the butt hurt and look at the facts. Seriously. Look at it. Look at it very closely and tell yourself this. Did I just say that? Did I just make myself sound like a butt hurt moron? To me, for me, for an example, uh, no, I don't sound like a bummer man. I sound like a guy who's laughing my ass off of the people who signed that petition because I honestly am one of those people who are looking forward to Super Mega Force coming out because of the fact that, well, what else? Go Kaijus. I absolutely love Go Kaijus. Kaijus is said Go Kaijus. I absolutely love it. Loved it. The concept of the Ranger Keys, the the usage of the whole thing behind it, the greatest treasure in the, in the universe, all that fun stuff. The Ranger Key is a good concept. I mean, hell, the only thing that I could appreciate from Super Me from Mega Force is the fact that the Ghost Game Warfare itself beats out the Japanese one, the Ten Soda. Uh, hell, it just beat it out because it had more functionality. That's what I actually liked. I, I had that purism in me. We like it. Oh, I'd rather have the Japanese one originally because I can then go be like change the Seija or it'll be like Skype Sword or, or Explosion, Skype the Power, all that fun stuff. But you know, I gotta give the uh, the Ghost Say more for a bit of a thumbs up. But I do want to see something interesting come out of the. Whatever the hell they're gonna call that, uh, Super Mega Force, uh, Mobirates, or whatever it may be. But, I wanna see a lot come out of it, and, dun dun dun, ground shaking, dun dun dun, I'm on, let's go, Auto Vision, let's go! And if you heard the Xbox, yes, I'm on Xbox, if not, then okay, I shouldn't have even mentioned that. 
Yeah, I'm still watching Shinken do it now. Ooh, what now? Huh, the purism, the butt hurt, all that fun stuff. When I first saw that post last night about the whole petition to stop Super Mega Force, it was a sign of butt hurt everywhere. <coughs> it was just complete and utter stupidity right there. Like, seriously. Guys, without Power Rangers, we wouldn't know about Super Sentai. A lot of people got lucky and were fortunate to watch Super Sentai only when they were young. Us? Not so much of a chance, but I cannot take anything away from my childhood. Honestly, I can't take anything away from childhood memories. You know what I mean? Because, I don't know, it's just purism, people like that. Seriously, wake up, smell the coffee a little bit. Try to really think about that. If you actually are a true Sentai Power Rangers, Kamen Rider, Mass Rider fan, whatever. And if you know your stuff, yeah, don't get so butthurt over it. Damn. Me, I already knew that we, there were a lot of stuff that Toei didn't come up with. The Saban did. That's their original ideas. Other than that, Hibiki, W, Decayed, W. All that fun stuff. Rate, comment, subscribe. Thanks for watching. God bless and aloha. Spoiler alert. Next video, we will be playing as Hibiki. Ha! Caught you off on that one, didn't I? Okay, bye.